What problem am I solving? Got a space associated with that saw's integrated fence. So maybe you've got a miter saw like this. If you've got stop block set up, maybe you've built a miter saw station or some other configuration where you've got a fence system like this. You can't reach into this range of the fence to create a stop block. So there are a few ways that you could normally do that. Say you've got a miter saw station and you've got a fence that stops at the edges of your miter saw. You could put a piece of wood in there, cut to the length of the difference between the place where you need the stop and the place where your stop block system stops. And if you were to do that, you would have to cut that difference block every time. And that's silly. So that's why I built this. That includes a way to make up the difference. This is a stop lock that slides the normal way with sort of a T-track system. And then it's got this little aluminum tube in it that allows me to adjust the difference. So I can, I can make up the difference for where the stop lock stops and the stop point begins.